Hi everybody, Peter here. I've got a massive stack of comics to go through, so let's show them off and see what we've got. First one is this. Ooh, what the shit's that? So, I should say, these are from Whatnot Sellers, eBay and all that kind of stuff. I've taken them out of the boxes, but I've forgotten when I bought them and why I bought them. I don't know what turf is. I think I bought this one off of Whatnot, which is bloody addictive. Um, and this is turf issue number one. And this is double signed. Now I've picked this up because it is double signed and it's signed by none other than Jonathan Wass. <laughs> See what I did there? Wass. Is that discriminatory? I don't know. Anyway, it's signed by Jonathan Ross and also by, who does it say in the back? Lee Edwards. Tommy Lee Edwards. No idea what this comic's about, but I don't have a Jonathan Ross signature in my collection, and I do quite like him. So, yeah. So I've picked this one up purely for the signatures. Oh! It's sexy! Look at that! Oh! This is a beautiful look and a copy of Strange Tales, um, and this is issue 158. It is, of course, the first appearance of the Living Tribunal. Now, I picked this up from a Facebook group. This is a really nice condition book. Um, I'm probably going to get this graded. Not that the Living Tribunal is a massively popular character, but it's an old school book. I love the cover and I do like the character. So, yeah, really pleased to have this one in the old collection. Next, we've got another Whatnot buy. No idea why I bought this. Didn't like it. Um, it'll go in my giveaway box. But it is, of course, the J. Scott Campbell Batman cover. A geek big, thick bound book. Um, nice cover artwork. I'm just not a big J. Scott fan. I know that's you know sacrilege for some, but he doesn't necessarily do it for me. This will go into my Saturday Night Live giveaway box. So if you want a chance of winning this, make sure you watch the Saturday show. Next, we picked up a three pack of free comic book days. Now, Peter, you might be saying, Peter, why are you buying books that are free? I don't even know. I do know. Um, I got it from Whatnot, and I got it because in one of these books, I don't know which one, I think it's the Judgment Day one, I don't know, uh, is the first appearance of Blade's daughter, I believe. So it's a minor first appearance, and I do like me first appearances. Oh, this is sexy. I've got a bit obsessed with this book. This is Young Avengers number one. This is the Wizard World Con exclusive cover, black and white cover. Quite a hard book to find, although it's not, because I've got three copies of the friggin' thing. <laughs> don't know why. Uh, it's a book that every time I say it, I have to pick it up. So like I say, I've got about three or four copies of this now. I'm going to send these off to be graded, pressed and graded, and then I'll keep the highest grade and probably sell the others. <laughs> I've got another copy. <laughs> Next, look at that beautiful, bald, big chested guy. We've got Black Adam. Mm, not a good movie. Not a good movie. Black Adam, um, but it's got an image of Dwayne The Rock Johnson on there. And it's signed by the artist, the cover artist, Ben Oliver, who's a stunning artist. So yeah, really, really pleased to have this one in the collection. Next, oh, I love it. We've got Lock Key number one. Massive fan of this series by Joe Hill. TV series was pretty good, started strong, ended poorly. But the book is friggin' amazing. So really pleased to have this in my collection once again. I had this graded back in the day and I sold it and regretted it. So pleased to have this one back. I will be getting this pressed and I will get it graded. Next, this is a funny little one. This is not something I would normally pick up. So this is Cyberforce. This is an Ashcan edition. Um, Cyberforce, not a book I read. Ashcan's not something I collect. So why have I bought it? Who knows? Anyway, this is Cyberforce number one. No, it's not. This is Cyberforce Ashcan edition, and it is signed by Mark Silvestri, which is why I've probably picked it up. I think this is quite a hard little booklet to find. Um, so yeah, it's quite nice. It's quite nice. It's got two signatures on there. Don't know, don't know who one of them is. Anyway, nice little book. Let us know in the comments if you collect Ashcan. It's not something I've ever really gone too much into, but I do quite like this little blue bookie. <laughs> and we'll end on a good one. This is a beautiful copy of X-Men 129, which is the first appearance of Kitty Pride. I'm saying that with confidence. Is it? Is it the first appearance of Kitty Pride? Sure it is. I'm sure that's why I've bought it. It's a sexy looking copy. 
it is really really nice the colors pop on it it's a pence copy but i didn't mind a pence copy um, and it's a beautiful key x-men book x-men books always in demand so yeah really pleased to have that one i'm doubting myself now and i'm just waffling here is it the first appearance of kitty pride oh i do it now man okay guys that's your whack thank you for watching please do let us know in the comments if that is the first appearance of kitty pride or if i've just gone mental Thanks a lot, and we'll catch you next time. Take care.